Hi, this is Chris Zitko. I'm one of the eComfort experts here. And I'm going to go through and I'm going to show you how to size an office for a home. You can use the mini split sizing calculator. Now, just a reminder, this is a calculator that's a general calculator. It's a room by room sizing calculator. You can use this for radiators. You can use it for garage heaters, so on and so forth. So my room size, it's 160. I'm going to say 90210 for our zip code here. Building age, I'm going to put it after 2000. It was 2010. Select room. We're going to make an office. Going forward, you see 2700 BTUs, heating load 1300 BTUs. As we continue, let's see if this changes. My desired indoor temperature, I'm going to have that at 70 degrees as well as my desired indoor heating temperature is 70 degrees. That's going to change it up just a little bit. But as we go into this, I have a 15 foot wall on that side. That's going to change these over. North wall is not exposed. East wall is exposed. South wall exposed. And I'm going to say west wall is exposed as well. Window details. I have one on the east, two on the south, one on the west. I'm going to put French door as a door entry in and out. Ceiling details. It is not exposed because there's another floor above that. Height, though, I'm going to say is nine feet. We're going to change that over. Floor details, it's slab on grade, so yes, it's exposed. Let's continue here. It has changed a little bit, 3,500 to 1,900. So I'm not sure if it's excellent insulation or not, so I'm just going to leave it as fair. Though I do know California tends to be low E compliant for new builds. Floor details as it keeps on going over a basement or crawl space. Nope, most California is going to be slab on grade. And I'm not sure if there's any insulation in that slab. Look at that. We've changed it to 3,600 and 3,100. I'm going to now hit submit and review results. Obviously, we have 3,600 and 3,100. You can now download this as a PDF to your desktop. You can print it or you can send it as an email over to yourself. This is going to go through and give you a full load calculation and all that information that you've entered in. Just as a heads up though too, 3600 to 3100, smallest unit that's normally out there is going to be like a Mitsubishi single zone for around 6000 BTUs. You can however use like an LG 9000 or um, just about any other manufacturer's 9000 that's out there. It should still get down to that low of a BTU load. If you do have any questions, please feel free to give us a call. We're actually going to go through and we're going to do selections on this and the next setup. Have a wonderful day.